A First Weather Book for Kids, All About Weather, by Huda Haraji, M.A. To Hassan and Emily. What is weather? Step outside. What does the sky look like? What does the air feel like? The sky is blue. The air feels warm. That's the weather. Weather changes all the time. It helps you decide how to spend the day. Weather also changes throughout the year. These changes are called seasons. Many places on Earth have four seasons. Spring, summer, fall, and winter. Spring weather is warm and rainy. It's when flowers start to bloom. Summer weather is hot and sunny. The air becomes cooler during fall and leaves change color. Winter brings cold air and sometimes snow. Near the middle of the earth, there are only two seasons, rainy and dry. How many seasons happen where you live? Thermometers tell us how hot or cold the air is. Higher numbers are hotter. Cooler num lower numbers are colder. Oh, I'm sorry, higher numbers are hotter. Lower numbers are cooler. Rain freezes and turns into snow at 32 degrees Fahrenheit or zero degrees Celsius. Is the sun shining today? Put on your coolest shades. What is the sun? The sun causes the weather on Earth. It provides light and warmth. The sun is actually a star. It's more than four and a half billion years old. The sun can make the air outside feel hot. Enjoy a sunny day by playing outside. Remember to wear sunscreen. You can ride your bike to the park or cool down at the beach. Is it windy? Quick, catch your hat before it flies away. What is wind? It is windy when the air around us moves. We can't see wind, but we can feel it. Enjoy a windy day by flying a kite or blowing bubbles. Windmills turn wind into electricity. Are there fluffy shapes floating in the sky? It must be cloudy. Cumulus clouds, stratus clouds, cirrus clouds, nimbus clouds. What are clouds? Warmth from the sun causes tiny water droplets to rise up into the sky. Those tiny droplets stick together and make clouds. Enjoy a cloudy day by lying in the grass and watching the clouds change shape. What shapes can you see? Name some. Clouds might look light and fluffy, but they're very heavy. One cloud can weigh more than one million pounds. That's the same as 100 elephants. Is it raining outside? Grab your umbrella. What is rain? Rain is water that falls from clouds. Rain has a very important job. It provides the water plants need to grow. A drop of water spends nine days in the sky before falling back to earth. Enjoy a rainy day by reading a book near a window. Listen to the raindrops. Is it snowy? Lace up those boots. What is snow? When rain freezes, it's called snow. Snow is icy and wet. Snowflakes are different shapes, but they all have six sides. Enjoy a snowy day by making snow angels. Maybe try ice skating. Is there a thunderstorm? 
Let's move the picnic inside. If you can hear thunder and see lightning, there's a thunderstorm. Thunderstorms also bring rain and sometimes wind. Thunderstorms form when cold air and warm air meet. Enjoy a stormy day by playing games with your family. Stay safe inside and keep away from windows during a storm. Try counting the seconds between lightning and thunder. The higher you count, the farther away the storm is. Look outside after a thunderstorm and you might see a rainbow. Rainbows form when light shines through raindrops. The seven colors in a rainbow are red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, and violet. Can you find all of those colors on this rainbow? Let's get ready for the weather. It's a cold, snowy day. Point to what you will need. It's raining. Point to two items you will need. Hmm. The weather is sunny and bright. Point to what you will need. Look at the clothes each person is wearing. Use your weather knowledge to decide which season they're in. Spring, summer, winter, or fall. You can go back and rewind the video and pause on any of these pages if you need more time. Now you're a weather expert. What is your favorite type of weather? Hmm, well, I love rainbows, but I also really like thunderstorms. And a good sunny day is always nice. That was All About Weather, a first weather book for kids by Huda Haraji, M.A. And illustrated by... Jane Sanders. And this is EDU Kids Space. Subscribe for more stories, books, and lessons. Hit the bell button so you're notified when I put out new videos. And if there's something in particular you want to hear about, leave me a message on the channel or a comment under the video. Thanks for listening.